Hey guys, today I will show how to repair a thermal level printer. So here is one level printer, model number BP700. You can see here, this printer is no power. Press the power button, it does not work. Here also plugging power cable. We just check it that this power adapter is okay or not and testing the power adapter output voltage. This is absolutely okay. 24 volt. Yes, we can see. Okay. Now we are plugging this in a printer. Here. Before we plugging, you can see here is a voltage setting. 24 volt. 2.5 ampere. Yes. There is the power button. It is not working. Okay. Uh, here is the big problem. That yeah. power is not working here. Maybe this meter is motherboard problem. Today I will fix this. How to repair this? And I will explain how I find out the problem. What is the problem? Okay, guys. Let's start. First of all, we open the back cover. You can see this is our motherboard. We need to open all connector, connection jack. Already removed the motherboard from printer. Okay. Then what next? Uh, for our working purpose, we need to connect this cable here. Sorry, this is for the here. Can you explain the, uh, this is why the we why we connect the cable? Uh, because what the, working? this kind of should come, come from this power button. You can see. That's uh, why we connect this cable. Okay. But earlier we have uh, to see that uh, you are unplugging all those cables yes. from the motherboard. Yeah. So this one is only working for the power. Power, 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 power button. button. Power button. That's why we connect this here. Okay, okay, okay. Without triggering this button, it's it actually don't work. you are finding that uh, the power is mainly problem in this printer in okay. this printer okay okay so yes. you have just plug in the power connector yeah. yes the power button connector power okay. button connector our power connection is here oh yeah, yeah. See. okay this is also connected now now i am plugging this power cable this power come but it not be is here you can see it's uh, power come but not staying. Staying. You can see there is the power button. It does not work anymore. That is okay. Now we need to find out where is the power button is work and how to work this power system. You can see here is a some MOSFET and transistor and some regulator. Uh, this is the main. Uh, the output voltage is through here. After that, this regulator will do work, and after after that, this regulator will do work, and this system. Okay. Now I uh, now I am checking the where is voltage available or not. Explain the all things in this motherboard. Yes, we are checking the voltage. Where is voltage available or not? Here is a 24 voltage. 
is also 24 voltage but output pin will is not voltage is not available you can see here this MOSFET work from this octocoupler you can see here is voltage is not or not available or not here is also voltage you can see here okay regular input voltage here is a no voltage available okay we need to work this MOSFET when I press the power button it will be get give some signal no signal available here this is the main power MOSFET and it works from octocoupler this octocoupler gets positive signal but get input signal from this from this transistor from for one two three four transition this is the circuit protection side uh, sometimes it occur any kind of high voltage or anything it will be protect the power supply and save the motherboard and another things okay now i am open the protection side after that i will show this what and not when i touch the power base button it that motherboard automatically power on okay just i need to check this here kind of here we can uh, see the blinking of the led yeah this is the status led this is the power button oh. the how which condition is printer we need to open this and check the transistor npn or pnp transistor pcnl or ncnl NPN transistor we will open the emitter to base connection this transistor base connection this side is only for protection this is the power protection side I will open the power protection uh, protection signal then I will check the system power is okay or not now it uh, need to be removed yeah. from the motherboard yeah which one this one this transistor uh, I, you can see yes. that this transistor base pin should be open after that, I will check the printer motherboard or not. So, now we are going to remove the transistor from the iron heater, okay? okay. Not transistor, just oh, this oh, what inside the yeah, base is to emitter this resistance. You can see. Okay, now I am plugging the power cable. You can see power is okay. Just I am oh, printer is beeping. We uh, we got the many more beep sound because of the disconnect uh, another cable and connector printer. Uh, is disconnected disconnected oh. now i am taking the printer pin, output voltage and some basic voltage which is always need to be done this printer yeah this is the output voltage from mosfet octocopper is run we are not getting any voltage yeah okay you can see here is a some voltage this is the pcnl mosfet that's why it's working the pnp transistor as, as same pnp transistor uh, you can see here is a regulator input voltage is okay 
just we are checking how much wood is out to here high ball no here also five volt and here is no voltage it, 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 this regulator is five volt regulator and two output five volt okay this is the protection register is open that's why we are getting some voltage here no will be emitter voltage okay viewers now we are connecting the wall cable after that we will check the printer this is absolutely okay or not okay first of all we are connecting the arcing cable this is the thermal heat cable This is the final test. Now this meter is ready now. Sticker holder and here is the ribbon holder. Yeah. 